Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. So today I'll be showing you my Hatsune Miku collection. Um, the Taito figures specifically as there is a lot of Miku figures. So first I'm gonna show you the doll, two doll crystal figures. First is the, I think it's just the first one, the blue, <laughs> Miku's normal colors. So this came out in 2018 and it is about six inches tall. So there's that Miku figure. Then after there is the Sakura Miku version. So this is the Sakura Miku version. This one's also from Taito. Well, all of them are going to be from Taito. Of course, they're the same height. I like this was probably one of the fig first figures I got during this whole as <laughs> this whole panini. Um, it came in the first order, and I was so happy to have her. I've never. It was the first time I was ever like ordering figures, so it was very enjoyable to see to like wait for them to arrive. And then I was like super worried, like, is it gonna arrive? And then of course they came. <laughs> Next is another Sakura Miku figure. It is it is from 2019. It is also about seven inches tall. She's a really cute figure. I'm glad that I got her. I got her for like 800 yen. And most of the time, I think she was like 2,000 or 3,000. I forgot. But she was, she was pretty pricey. So I'm glad that I got her for, for really cheap. And I don't mind not having the box. It's not really that much of a big deal. I would rather have the figure. So next is the 2019 birthday Miku. She is around 7 inches tall and she was released in 2019 as you can tell with the, you know, birthday. <laughs> Here she is. I really like this one. She does come with, I mean not come with, she does have a variant and her variant is a pink version of her. I really like this one because I like the winky winky face. It was really, it's really, really, really cute. <laughs> have that winky face. All that details. I love the golden chain and oh, the little diamonds on her like so cute. I love the little diamonds. And even the diamonds on her like stockings are really cute as well. She's so adorable. At the back. Ooh. So next is another birthday Miku. She is the 2020 birthday Miku. Uh, she probably stands as well as a seven inches tall. She's super cute though. Um, the colors are so much bright. I guess more vibrant on the camera, but she's more of like a. Um, she's still more of like a, the fuchsia like vibrant pink. Isn't she adorable? I love her face. 13th, 13th anniversary. Mm, and her face. Her face is really cute. There we go. Super cute. And I love her crown. Her crown's kind of like all of the time. <laughs> there we go. So next up is a few winter Miku figures. This is just the Miku figure. Um, an, a winter one. I have the renewal version. Um, the original version is like a nice like crystal blue, but I like this one a lot more because I love purple and purple is wonderful. When I received this figure, the one thing that was weird about it was it didn't fit into the actual peg. I had to, there was a paint error and I had to like scrape down um, the actual peg so it fit into the base and that was kind of scary because this figure was one of my first 
figures that I ordered over from Mandarake. It was like one of the first batches of trying out the website, wondering if it was a, a good website, and yes, it's a very good website. <laughs> so this one, this is next. This is the, the Winter Image Miku. Um, she also, I think, as well as the other one, I think they came out in 2020. Uh, this one is, to me, it's very unique. I love the shorts. Miku doesn't always wear shorts, or at least a lot of the times they don't put her in shorts. And I find that a little new. I find that very refreshing. It's very cute and adorable. I love the little stripes on the side of it and the, oh, the little bows. Like, this one is very packed with a lot of, like, little cute details and ruffles. And even though it's a it's the same co a color palette kind of over, I like that they use it in different spots. So the the yellow and the pink from the little like I think shawl or something at the top here or bonnet to the, the leggings. I think that's really 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 adorable. The shoes and the shoes are so beautiful. They're simple but they're gorgeous. There is, again, there's a bunch of variants, I think, of this. Actually, no, I think there's only one other variant, and it's, like, more of, I think, a blue. So this is another Winter Miku. She is the Winter Live Miku Special. I She has a regular version, but I just had to get the special one because the special one is just... I love the pink and the turquoise, and I like that um, it matches her hair. And the pink just adds to you know her cute blue outfit that she um the cute blue and pink outfit and her hair and i just love how this this is but all in all i love this figure this is probably one of my favorites cafe miku so this one is so adorable i was looking forward to this one okay some people was like her face is sadistic but I actually kind of like it. Um, I like the smile. I love the cheeriness. I I can see what guess what they're talking about, but I just I like this a lot. Um, I think the cafe theme styles or just the 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 cute styles that um, Taito seems to do very often. I think it's very beautiful. I think they do a good job with like picking certain stuff lately um furry's been kind of getting in the miku game a little bit harder and they've been doing like flavors like there's a vanilla flavor coming out soon and then oh, i want the mint chocolate <laughs> flavor um outfit um this figure has i think two variants a purple variant as well as a pink variant but i prefer the original a lot more because I think that one is just a lot more beautiful, to be honest. Okay, my next figure is one of my favorite figures. Because it's just, she's so adorable. She is the Hanafuku Hatsune Miku figure. And she has a color variant that I think is ugly. But a lot of people like that color variant. But I think it's atrocious. Um, her dress is really pretty. The leggings are a little tacky, but you know what? I'll, I, I usually just let that one slide <laughs> because I love it so much. I adore, adore her backpack. That is just like the most adorable thing I've ever seen. Everything is so adorable. I love her, I like how her ponytails, her pigtails like twist and like kind of like curl in yeah, oh, so adorable. And even like her shoes. Oh, she's so adorable. Okay, last but not least, this is the another one of one of my favorite figures. This is Taito's. Um, I think it's summer, um, summer season figure. This is the apparent. I think it's called the Sega Limited Affiliation figure it is pretty much just a pink version of the original which the original is like a gray and um a little gray kind of more sailor colors um there is a renewal that's yellow and i think the renewal is kind of gross <laughs> and i like this version a lot more 
Like, look at it. Look at the face. Beautiful. And I love her little floaty. And I think it says, let me turn it around. It says, me, me, ku, ha, su, ne. Which I find really cute that it says her, her name. Her little hat is just the adorable, like, like the details in it. Her base is cute too. It has like just the sailor theme and all the dolphins on it. Just, just adorable. The sun, seashells by the seashore. I just love the like stripe pattern on the bottom of her dress. That's really cute. And it goes like all around. So this is my Miku Taito collection. Thank you all for watching this video. Um, they all appreciate you watching them. And they appreciate watching you. Bye-bye!